What's up guys, Nepenthes here and welcome back to another squad building challenge. There is a Tipiligayan player of the year, SBC, and his card looks pretty damn good. Jensen, the special card. You need five Tipiligayan players, three Danish players, one inform player, three nationalities, chemistry of 95. So let's start off, guys, with the um, the Tipilege. I apologise if I'm saying it wrong. Um, so you need five of these. So let's go for... Wait, is it exactly three? Day Denmark players, minimum three. So let's just go here, like so. Was it a rating as well, or was it just... No rating. Wow, perfect. Let me just throw in all of these dudes. Do do do. Do, 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 do. Right, there we go. Um, so we'll throw in the goalkeeper. I don't care how much... Like, you're not going to be able to do this for cheap, right? Because people are going to make these expensive. But you need just five of these players, which isn't difficult. And they don't have to be gold. They could be bronze. That's not a problem. Um, so don't use silvers like I've used. Use Be, 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 be sensible. Be sensible with yourself. Um, we'll throw him in there. We'll throw him in there. We'll put in the centre midfielder there. And we'll put in a centre midfielder there. And we'll put in the left midfielder. And that's going to take care of pretty much everything that we need uh, for the tricky stuff. So Denmark players. Oh, wait. We need three Danish players as well. Let me uh, let me go here. Go nation, nationality. Uh, let's go to D. This is going to be quite an easy one to finish, to be perfectly honest. I might actually take a minute and try and get it done cheaper and quicker. Um, so we'll have... Let me go for a right back... A centre mid, I need a centre back and a right mid. A striker as well would be helpful. We have uh, this untradeable guy here. Let's throw th those in. So we'll throw him in at centre back. We'll throw the right back in at right back, of course. Uh, like so. We'll put the centre mid up in here. So we only need 95 chemistry. Uh, we need three nations. Um, let's throw that up into there. So... I don't know if this is going to work necessarily. What am I missing out on here? I'm missing out on the centre-back here. We need five... Mm, I don't know. I'm tempted to try and do this a bit quicker. A bit easier. Sorry, a bit cheaper than just using the players that I have. Let's throw this guy in. Uh, actually, let's throw this guy in. Um, quite a lot of uh, uh, players that could be worth a bit here. Now, that puts us up to 96. Now, if we get rid of this guy, what does that take us down to? 89. Right, so I'm going to need a chem boost somewhere. Um, if I have a Denmark, I need a Danish player basically, um, a Danish centre back, this guy here, the, the Bromby guy is going to be the dude, let me just uh, have a look how much he's going for right now, oh god, 4k, wow 4k for this guy, that's crazy expensive, um, so this is the team that I've built here. I, we're going to take a look at the transfer list in a second as well, because I think we can do this cheaper. I, I, I know we can do this cheaper. Five Tipiligayan players, three Danish players, one Team of the Week player, three nations exactly. So what you're going to want to get is, I want to go and have a look at bronze players um, to see what we've got going on with the bronzies. Uh, to see if we can do this super cheap. And you need three nationalities. And, and I'll, I'll explain why I haven't put the inform in yet. Because it's going gonna, it's gonna to make it like quite easy, I think. Uh, so we go here. Yeah, see, so you've got loads of players here available to you. Um, for 200s. So I want to actually have a look at what we've got. So it's nationalities, maximum three. So we want to go for... Um, let me put this down here like this so you want to go for the danish players basically so this striker sorry the norwegian players um so the the striker there would be good the left back would be good the goalkeeper would be good let me let me let me build this team let me build this team for cheap so we'll start with goalkeeper 200 coin goalkeeper uh, we definitely want it to be a norwegian so we're going to throw the nationality in here and, and this is the reason i know i'm probably going to take a little bit longer on this than i would like to have done so the reason why I'm going to be doing so is because I want you guys to be able to complete this cheap. I don't want you to spend money on this dude. I want you to get him done cheap. So you've got an abundance of Norway goalkeepers here. Just go and buy one Norwegian goalkeeper from the league. Uh, we'll send him into the club. Happy days. 200 coins spent. I reckon we can get this done for less than 3,000 coins. And all you're getting for it is the one player as well. So you don't, you really don't want to be spending too much. Um... Two centre-backs, again, you want the two Norwegians, not, I mean, 
If you can get them like these guys from the same club, perfect. Uh, it doesn't look like uh, Barstad. <laughs> this bar, this Barstad. Uh, can we get this guy? No. Okay. It looks like everyone's having the same uh, same opinion as me. Um, let's go for this guy and this teammate of his here. Okay, he's gone. Let's go for this one. No, he's gone. So what are we looking for? It, it doesn't have to be this club. Uh, it can be. Um... All right. So we've got. So that's three of them done. We've got two centre backs. Now I want to get a left back and a right back. Okay, we've already got Jets, Jets, uh, th this this guy. So I'm gonna list him back up for 200 because we already have him. But we bought him for 200, so that's his uh, that's his going rate. We now want a Danish right back and a Danish left back. Sorry, a Norwegian right back and a Norwegian left back, and then we're good um, for the defence. The defence would have cost us just a thousand coins, and I think that's going to be important in the uh, in the grand scheme of things. And bear in mind, guys, you can do these with bronzes. You don't have to waste money on golds. You don't have to waste money on silvers. You can absolutely do these with bronzes. The only problem might be is if the centre backs need. Uh, we've, we've actually got triple links anyway. I'm going to go ahead and take a look at the. Um, I'm going to go ahead and take a look at the team now and see where we're at with it, where we stand. So let's go into the squad building challenges. I wonder if we're going to get another one today as well, because just having one is a bit... It's a bit in there, isn't it? It's a bit like, wait, what? Um, right, so we've got the goalkeeper there. I want, to, um, I want to remove him. Actually, let me just do it the easy way. So we want to go bronze, right back. Um, nation is going to be Norwegian. L-M-N, Norway. So our bronze right back is going to be this guy. Our bronze centre back is going to be this guy. Wait, didn't we get another bronze centre back? What happened to my other bronze centre back? Did we already have him in the club? Oh, did I buy the same guy twice? Oh, idiotic. Okay. Um, that's no problem. I have to go and buy another bronze centre back, right? Uh, so send to my club. And you need to put in a... Is it a team of the week player? Yeah, exactly one team of the week player. Um, so we're going to go and get ourselves another Norwegian centre-back. Doesn't matter what club it's from. It literally doesn't matter what club it's from. We just need a Norwegian centre-back. Um, which is going to be uh, very... Should, we should be able to still pick them up for 200 coins. Yeah, there's still, there's still an abundance of them. So any Norwegian centre-back. This guy is a good shout. Okay, he's not a good shout because he's gone. Um, this guy... No, he's gone. Let's move on to the next page. I mean, there's so many pages of these dudes that it's, I, I find it hard to believe that they're all going to be extinct. There you go. So we've got another 200 coin player. So that's the defense done for 1,000 coins. Now, for the midfield, you need four Danish players. So the best thing to do is to go to the Danish league um, and then go for uh, Danish players. Denmark. And we'll have a look. First, right midfield. Yeah, perfect. We can get right mids. We can get the whole set here. This is great. So we're going to need a... We've got five. We're going to need four midfielders. We're going to need a right mid, two centre mids, a left mid, and a CDM. That's right, isn't it? Yeah, that is right. So we'll start off with the right mid. We'll pick him up. Happy days. Okay, he's gone. Let's move on to the next right mid. This guy. Okay, perfect. So we've got Brun there. Brun is going to cost us 200 coins. Doesn't matter what club you get these guys from, as long as they come, as long as they're Danish, um, it's not a big problem. Let's have a look at CDMs. We're gonna get a CDM in here as well. Perfect. Wow, there's an absolute abundance of this guy. He's that one's gone. Let's see if we let, let's let's click through a couple of pages. And if I'm doing this still now, guys, as well, like very deep into this being a squad builder challenge, you guys are able to do it as well for 200 coins. The bronze packs are like loads of people open bronze packs, so there's always going to be a load of these guys on the market. Um, let's be sensible and just click through a few pages to start. Look at that. There is pages on pages of these guys for 200 coins. So if if you're thinking oh, I'm never going to be able to get these guys. Look how many there are for 200 coins. And then, then you've got to imagine the pages for 250 and 300. Like, you, honestly, it's going to be... If you spend too much money on this, it, you're, you're just an idiot, unfortunately. You don't want to be spending anything on these players. So there's no left backs. Let's have a look at left wings. There you go. We can grab a, we can grab a left wing. Let's see if uh, we can actually get these guys. Oh, yeah, perfect. There's not so many of the left wings, but um, you might have to spend a little bit more money on the left mid. Failing that... If you can't get a Danish person, just get someone who has the same club as where you're going. So um, you don't have to have Denmark here. You can just do that and get any Danish left mid from a club that you already have a centre mid from to get that strong link for. I think that's going to leave us um, perfectly done needing just 
one um, informed player. I think it's just going to leave us needing the one informed player. Uh, this is going to be an extremely cheap uh, squad builder challenge as well. So we want centre back, we want bronze. Do I have? I don't have many bronze centre back, so he can go in there. Um, and that's the defence done. Then the right mid, we throw this guy in. We throw in at centre mid uh, this guy. We also throw in at centre mid this guy. So what you want to do from these 10 players before you look at the striker is you want to get um, 95 or as close to 95 chemistry as possible. Um, if you can't get the chemistry, feel free to use the no loss glitch. If you guys don't know what the no loss glitch is, to get chemistry, the loyalty glitch, just type into YouTube Nepenthes loyalty glitch and it will come out. Uh, or come up for you. So everyone here, for me, I've, I'm actually short on chemistry at the moment, unless I put in a striker and a position change. Now, we have two nations. We have Sweden and Denmark. We have the three Denmark players. We have the five Tipilagayan players. And all we've spent so far is 200 coins per man. 10 players. We've spent 2,000 coins so far. That is it. The, the expensive thing that you're going to have is going to be the inform. Like, the inform is going to be, like, how are you going to... How are you going to get an inform for cheap, basically? Unfortunately, you can't use loan players, otherwise that would be pretty sweet. But for me, I don't even know if I have many uh, cheap informs available. Um, this guy might be quite cheap, although he's 84 rated. Um, do we have any uh, other... I don't. I just don't really have many informs. Um, let's take a look at how much he's going for. Now, I, knew, I, I had a feeling something like this was coming. I knew I should have uh, trusted my instincts and maybe stacked up on these. This guy's at 20,000 coins by the looks of things. But I want to go and find. I want to go and see if I can find a player worth less than twenty thousand coins as an inform, because this is where the real money goes into it. Basically, this is where like the the bulk of it comes. So we want to go special card. We don't care about anything other than it being a special card. Uh, and then we want to go and take a look at like let, let's go up to like fifteen k to start with and see if we can get an inform for fifteen k. Oh wow! Oh look at that. There's loads of them. Well, I do want a striker as well. A striker for me is uh, is going to be quite important. So any special striker cards? If in fact, if we can get one from the uh, the uh, uh, the league, the uh, same league or, or whatever, that would be even better. Thirteen thousand coins. Look at that. This Luis guy, twelve k for pay, pay, paying for him. Al Sommer, twelve k. The Brazilian guy, twelve k. This silver guy, thirteen k. There is absolutely plenty of players for you guys to be able to pick up. For your inform to the point where this whole this entire player of the year guy is going to cost you about fifteen thousand coins. Look at that, we can get him, him, or him. Um, so eleven thousand coins or ten thousand seven fifty for the bronze guy here. Um, we'll take him if he. Okay, so he's already gone. We might actually struggle to get these at this cheap. No, there you go. We get ourselves. Uh, What's this guy's name? Falata. Falata. Now, I don't know if I'm going to have the chemistry, so I might have to use um, one of my own players, or I might have to just be diff I might have to like change the team completely and, and use those silvers that I had. But I want to show you guys that you can do it, because for the sake of the video, I want to get it done straight away. Um, so I'm not going to sit here and do the no loss glitch. Um, so if we go like this and like this, uh, we'll put the striker in here. Is this the one that I bought? Didn't I, didn't I buy a silver one? I don't mind using him, but yeah, so we bought this guy, um, and it, that puts us to 87 chemistry, so we're way, way short on the chemistry. However, we only need three Denmark players, so the three midfielders in the centre here could be good enough for us. The defence is fine, so if we've got any Saudi League left mid and Saudi League right mid, that would be perfect. Um, I think that would be enough. I don't think I have any Saudi League players in my club, but we'll have a look. Um... But they would also have to be from the same nation as this guy as well. Oh, I do have loads. Wait, where are we looking at? So we're looking at an actual Saudi player. So I need a Saudi left mid and a Saudi right mid, which I don't have. So I'm going to have to go and buy them. And I hope, I hope this will give me the chemistry that I need. I think it will. Um, I think it's good enough to get it. So let's go and get ourselves a Saudi league left mid and a Saudi league right mid. And uh, see if this is going to be... Uh, See if this is going to be enough for us. Let's go right mid. And again, we don't really want to spend any money on these at all. Let's go 200 left mids. And it ha like as I say, like being a Saudi player is obviously... In fact, what club was that guy from? If we can get the same club as well... Let me go and have a look at what club he was from. Because I want to get... I actually want to get from the same club. Because then we'll be able to get... Then it will just be perfect for us. It'll be uh, very, very easy. Squad building challenges. Um... Tipper Tipper Ligayan 
player of the year. He is from um, Al Weda. So if we can get a left mid and a right mid from Al Weda, uh, that would be absolutely perfect. And this would be a very, very simple, very, very cheap way to do this. So club uh, Al Weda. Where is Al Weda? There. So there's no uh, left mid. There is a right mid for 200 coins, which is perfect. So we'll take the right mid for 200 coins. Uh, that's one done. Let me just make sure this is the... Uh, is the, I, I, think, I think it's the same nation. We'll take a look at left wings as well from Alueda, uh rather than left, uh, left mids. So let's go and take a look at left wings. Nothing. Let's, uh, let's just see what we've got. No left wings at all. And left mid. No left mids at all. So we'll take any... Um, Basically, any uh, Saudi league left mid that is also from Saudi. So we'll take this guy. I think, guys, I think this is going to be enough. And I'll explain the theory behind it and I'll explain the mechanics behind it and stuff at the end. And I'll explain for you guys how best to do it as well if you can't get hold of this guy that I've got hold of. Because obviously, this striker that I've picked up for 11,000 coins, like, you're not all going to be able to get him for 11,000 coins. That's just going to be a fact, right? That's, it's just, it's going to be an absolute fact. So let's go uh, here, go bronze. Uh, we'll throw him in there. And we will throw the other guy in here who should get perfect chem. Um, Al Fazi there. So that should be enough for us. Wow, we're only at 91 chem. Where am I missing chem from? Oh, the midfielders. All right. Um, so for me to get the bonus chem, I need to get the this midfielders. I need an ACH an LYN or an FCN centre midfielder or CDM. Let me go and have a look. And I said to you guys, this, like the, the perfect links might be, uh, they might be, might be relevant and that they, that's still true. Let's go to the, uh, all the way back up. Oh no, wait, where's the, uh, where's the Danish league? Have I gone past it already? So let's have a look at the first club, this one. So I want a centre midfielder from these. And there are some. Oh, there's lo. oh wait, it has to be Danish centre midfielder. Oh, there's even loads of those as well. Uh, let me go to Nation and go to Denmark and go here. And there are just, again, pages of this guy. Now, this shouldn't be the same guy that we've already got, I don't think. It's not. All right. I think I now think this, guys, is enough to uh, complete the challenge. If I, I might be off by one chemistry point, which would be very disappointing. Um, but I think, I think we're good. I think we're good. And it's actually taken me an incredibly long time to uh to finish this but it will be worth it so let me actually let me list this guy uh let me list this guy up let me sell him for 200 get my money back for him it's only 200 coins but hey and we'll go to here and here and we'll throw this guy in here and that puts yes yeah, so i am one chemistry point off and that one chemistry point is here the left mid or the right mid now we don't have a left mid to get see if you can get a perfect link for your striker and two right wings you'll be great because they get perfect chemistry but now i'm going to need to get another center midfielder another danish center midfielder from the ach team so let's go through the concept players um concept the danish league denmark and what is the is it is it argus it's not argus ac horsens yes it is ac horsens so it's going to be not that guy it's going to be this guy that we want um so hopefully we don't have to pay more than 200 coins for this guy. 150, two, no, there we go, perfect, 200 coins. Boom, there you go guys, so that is that, that is it complete. The theory behind it is, what you wanna do is go and get a full Norwegian defense, if you can get them from the same club, better yet, because if I had stronger links in at these uh, two center backs, if they had like the same clubs and the same nations, they would actually get 10 chem, because the, they have so many links going into them that they would get them. The more perfect links you can get, the better. So if you can get same club and same nation, perfect. If not, we've spent 200 coins a man on all of these bronze players, right? Defense, 9 chem, 9 chem, 9 chem, 9 chem, goalkeeper with 10 chem. If you can't get it, if you're like me and you find yourself short on chem a bit, we could have easily done the no-loss glitch. We would have got four more chem from the centre-backs at the defence, one more from the CDM, one more from the right mid, one more from the left mid, one more for the striker. It would have been plenty. We would have been like well, well within our rights. So if you can't find the midfielders like I've got, where it's the same club, same league and same nation, all for 200 coins each or three or 400 coins, which would be okay. If you're looking at spending six, seven, 800 coins a man, 
don't do it and do the no loss glitch instead. If you can spend the 200 coins and get the players though, that's what you want. So we've got perfect trio of players from the same club, same league, same nation in the middle. All five Tipula Gay and players in defence and goalkeeper, all from Norway to give a perfect chem. And then depending on your inform at striker, that will change, in my opinion, what you go with. If you've got, let's say you don't have a striker in form and you have this guy here, this, this, let's say you've got a right mid, you don't necessarily have to play him at striker. You can put the right mid in a right mid. Now you can go and get yourself a Danish striker to go here. And in fact, let me, let me actually do it. Let me go and uh, show you exactly how, how that would work if you had a different position. Because I want to show you guys what a different position would offer up. So a Danish striker, any position... Um, we would want. It, I just, I just don't want to spend more than 200 coins on him. Is the problem? Uh, so I might have to go through. Uh, no, it has to be, has to be Danish. I don't want to spend 10,000 coins. Let me go and get a na nation. Denmark. Boom. There we go. So let's go and make sure we get one for 200 coins. There's bound to be a Danish striker here for 200. Might have to go. Oh, there we go. 200 coins for him. So he's expired. Let's go on to the next page. This guy. There we go, right. So we've got a Danish striker, perfect. And then, if you get the left mid, you also want to be a Danish left mid. If that makes sense. Uh, so Denmark, bronze, left mid. Um, you want, again, like, if you pay 300, 400 coins, no problem. You just don't want to pay, like, stupid amounts of coins. Like, like these looking like they're going for, like, 2,000 coins or so right now, uh, which you don't really want to pay... But if you have to, then then hey, you have to. If you have to splash out on one or two players here or there, that's not a problem. Um, I'm hoping we can go and get a... Let me actually go to the transfer market and see if we can get a left mid for the right, uh, the right price. Because I want to give you guys a couple of alternatives. Because people sometimes get confused and feel like they have to do it the same way that I do it. When that's actually not the case. Uh, you can quite often do it far, far cheaper, far, far easier. So there's no left mid. But if we've got a left wing, we'll be fine with a left wing. No left wings either. Nothing for 350. Might be that the left mid left wings are, are problematic. Um, let's see what we've got for 850. All right, 850. So you can get this guy. You, you can get a guy, if you're quick enough on the market, you'll get him for like 800 or so. I mean, I don't mind paying 800 coins for a left mid. Um, you, if Better yet, open bronze packs and you'll get them for 400 coins, like a lot easier. But just to show you guys as an alternative... Um, the reason why it has to be a Danish player as well is because you need the nation to be the same. So we now, in fact, we even get a perfect link with our striker, which is even better. Uh, let's go to bronze and throw this guy in. And now that will give us the chemistry as well. So even if you don't have all of the players that I had, if you don't have the striker and the two wingers like I had them, if you've just got a random player, it doesn't matter if you've got a right mid here or if you've got a striker here. I think you'll still get the chemistry. Well, without... With, without Doing the no loss glitch, you don't get the chemistry. But what you can do is then go and use a no loss glitch and any single, any inform, goalkeeper, striker, left back, doesn't matter. You can put them in at right mid here and you'll get yourself uh, perfect. And in fact, if you had some position modifiers, you can convert this guy down to a cam and it get the chemistry needed. Um, in fact, let me just show you that it works as well. Like, don't, don't go wasting your chem styles if you don't need to. Um, but you can convert this guy down... Uh, so just to show you like if you've got any midfield or anything like that uh, striker to centre forward and then centre forward to cam should give him two chemistry I believe or maybe it's cam to centre mid that gives him the chemistry it might just be cam to centre mid cam to centre yeah there you go cam to centre mid so if you've got a central centre mid uh, in, in form you could throw him there that gives us a chemistry as well now I, because I bought this guy this this team cost me 11,000 for him, 800 for this guy, and then like 2,000 for the rest of them. It literally cost me 14,000 coins to complete this. That's it. It's so cheap. And if you've already got an untradeable inform or a bronze inform that you bought for cheaper than 11,000 coins, basically the price of your inform is the price of this squad builder challenge. So we're going to turn this in now. We're going to get this special Jensen card. And it actually looks like a really good card. Uh, good pace, good dribbling, good shooting, good physical, 79 passing. 70 defending, he's got high, high work rates, 4 star weak foot, 5 foot 10 tall, that is a brilliant card for sure. So we're going to send him into the club, I'm going to go and have a look, see if there's any special packs as well guys, because if there's some special packs, as per most squad builder challenges, we'll, uh, we'll open them as well, but 
that was um there are special packs happy days what are they Ooh, 25k packs let's go um yeah so there you go guys it's a super super cheap way to complete it like it's literally costing you like twelve thousand coins we get varan what a what a great start to these packs um yeah you like it's so it's so cheap and uh, the reason why i wanted to show you guys two ways and potentially more ways to do it is because what usually happens is when i do these videos i make the video and everyone goes and buys the exact same players that i buy which drives the price of those players to become extortionate prices and then everyone's like how did you do it so cheap it, these players just aren't this you know aren't this cheap so by showing you like an alternative method um it's it's short like hopefully you understand that you don't have to do it the same way this is the method Forget the players that are in there. Think about the way that I did it. Think about the chemistry styles, like, like the chemistry systems I put together. So you want your five Tipilagayan defenders and goalkeeper, you know, four defenders and goalkeeper. You then want to put your inform in somewhere and where your inform goes, that depends on how the rest of the, the team works for you. So uh, hopefully you understand what I'm talking about. Uh, I don't think it's too complicated, but I know some, like, some people just struggle mentally with this sort of stuff. Some people, you know, um, you know, maybe they're just a little too young. They don't really understand it or they, they just struggle with this kind of thing anyway So hopefully I'm here to help if this did help you uh, Definitely drop a thumbs up if we can get a special card. That'd be awesome Like that's you know, every time we do these squad builder challenges we end up getting a, a pretty good special card But don't don't necessarily as well be like me and and waste coins for the sake of wasting coins For example that left mid that we bought I didn't need to buy him. I'd already completed it without buying him um, the reason why I bought him was to show the other the other method and then converting my striker down to a centre mid to complete it, you don't need to do that. In, instead, you could have just gone and done the no loss glitch. It would have taken 10 minutes, but it would have saved you the coins that you would have spent for converting him down, which would have actually been about four or 5,000 coins that I probably would have wasted on those position modifiers. Fortunately for me, I have so many in the club anyway that it actually doesn't matter to me too much. Um, but for some of you guys... You don't have that like free access to those players. So instead, either go to the first uh, iteration that I did and happy days. Or secondly, um, go use a no-loss glitch and, and do it like that. Now, our packs here have been pretty tragic. We did get Harry Kane. Uh, we also got Varane. Um, and that's about it really, isn't it? So two packs to go. An inform, a legend, a Movember card. Lots of stuff in there. No walkout. Not here anyway. No, We've only got like two big flares as well. It's pretty... Uh, pretty disappointing pretty disappointing but uh, we'll throw the players up into the tray pile anyway i've still got i've so i've always got like 70 80 items on my tray pile and then for our last pack do we get anything good no walkout here today no big flare here today this guys is going to be the end of the video if you did enjoy it be sure to leave a like rating comment and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already but for now guys i'm out peace